guys, Enog Playster bringing you guys another video. Today is going to be Tap Titans 2 Part 264. Hope all of you guys are having an absolutely fabulous day. Today is a tournament day, but before we get into the tournament, I want to go ahead and uh, say a big thank you guys. Thank you so much for all the support on the videos and on the streams. If you guys don't know, I stream every tournament down below in the description is a link to my twitch and i stream like i said every tournament i'll stream um some days like today i joined last second so i'm going to be streaming after but if you guys haven't already it's toss me a follow down below in the comments or in the description but we're gonna go ahead and hop right into this tournament this is gonna be the skill points and perks tournament i have done so much preparation leading up to this tournament i was saying in yesterday's video i think this is the most amount of preparation that i've ever done for a non-tournament day you know a couple days ago i had like 17 or 18 uh prestiges it was just absolutely crazy the amount of preparation yesterday had a lot as well so we're gonna go ahead and join the tournament here again last seconds so we're gonna go ahead and join with five seconds left there hopefully that's gonna be our lucky number and get us another really really low tournament because like i said in yesterday's video the last three that we've done we've actually done three tournaments now where we've joined last second and two of them have been okay and one of them was absolutely great so i'm hoping we can get another one where we only have uh you know maybe two other people one other person whatever the case may be and as well as uh you know we're not missing out on a lot of time because obviously i stream today and then i stream tomorrow morning as well so if we lose out on like three hours or something that's really gonna affect what time i have to stream and stuff like that so Let's go ahead and take a look enough, you know, putting it off and stuff like that. I think this was honestly <laughs> kind of a worst case scenario. So we lost nearly three hours, three hours, and we have a jam packed tournament. So they haven't really pushed that much. Our max stage is still above the guy that's in first place. So I'm not too concerned about that, but this is a jam packed tournament. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know if anyone's even got to their max stage yet. It doesn't look like anyone has, to be honest with you. Um, this guy's max stage is actually, it's a little weird how they decide to put, uh, or who they put in your tournaments, but this guy is 140 stages above my max stage, which is kind of crazy. That's a lot. That is a lot for sure. That's a lot of pushing potential that I'm going to have to make up, uh, you know, make up for Then this guy's already has it. You know what I mean? So we're going to go ahead and we're going to switch builds here in a little bit. We're going to switch builds soon. Um, and kind of see how that goes. Hopefully, we can go ahead and get uh, a, a decent amount done here. It is actually still really, really cheap to go ahead and reset your skill tree. So if you guys haven't already, reset your skill tree. Um, it's actually only 50 diamonds right now. So it's 75% off. But if you have purchased the event pass, you get it even cheaper. So it's actually only 50 diamonds to go ahead and reset your skill tree right now. So if you guys want to mess around with builds or anything like that, do it right now. Now is the time. Uh, you have until until the 20 seconds we have lots of time here to go ahead and experiment with different builds and stuff like that one build i really do want to try is a hs build a heavenly strike build but unfortunately my passives just aren't where they need to be to even make that build useful i've actually used a uh heavenly strike like calculator basically to tell me if it's worth using heavenly strike or if i'm just not going to be powerful enough and it literally just says rip as soon as i put in all of my stats and stuff like that my skills my passives it just says rip like it's it's not even worth trying so the heavenly strike we may not be doing anytime soon but you know maybe a shadow clone you know push build or something like that if you guys haven't done that before you know maybe shadow clone farm build any of those if you guys haven't messed around with any builds do that now because it's super super cheap like i said and i do want to kind of start experimenting a little bit more because it's so cheap right now i'm not super concerned but i do plan on probably keeping a, uh, a hybrid build in the future so i know we talked about that a lot in yesterday's video so i don't want to get too into it but i do plan on keeping that probably the normal as soon as this uh you know double or you know really really cheap skill point uh whatever you want to call it skill tree reset until that goes away i'll probably continue to switch between a push build or maybe even you know a farm build to a hybrid build or a farm build to a push build i'm not sure but the farm build is really really nice especially because right now we're going for top 10 percent so I, I, you know, I, I've kind of decided that I do want to go for top 10. It was a little, a little difficult for me to, you know, really go in, but I feel like we're doing pretty good so far. We'll go and collect all of our dailies and stuff like that and see how many presents we're currently at. Uh, let's go ahead and collect, collect the rest of these fairies. Hopefully, uh, I was going to say, hopefully getting us a couple more presents, but unfortunately not. Uh, let's go ahead and collect. We got our daily reward. Day nine is going to be another equipment piece. So unfortunately, nothing good. We actually did get a legendary uh, just before I started recording, actually. 
we we'll go and sell all those it was this pet one um so this was a legendary piece we got it I, it's either not for a uh, set or we already have this one so uh, i'm not too sure but something stinks is the one that we actually got we can actually try to find this legendary slash if we go here something stinks legendary slash a little weird but um we'll see if we can actually find it it may have just not been part of a set i didn't even bother to look uh yeah it looks like it isn't even part of a set which is okay uh because i'm obviously not going to be spending any of our diamonds on sets or anything like that for a little while here because we're on that grind to purchase our very first uh titan chest which hopefully is going to be coming fairly soon uh 5140 diamonds and literally we're just waiting on the next tournament i'm going to go ahead and save it for a crafting chart tournament um i think that's going to be probably the best thing to do uh, but we will actually be able to go ahead and get a Titan chest that tournament and as well as finish Angelic Guardian. So the next tournament, the Crafting Shirt tournament, watch out for that one, you guys, because I am hopefully going to be able to smash that one. I'm really looking forward to it. Uh, client info here. Um, not sure what that was about. It's so an F-bomb and clicked off. That's okay. Uh, but we did. We are in the middle of a raid attack here. So if we go ahead and take a look uh wow we're actually really really close to transitioning into the next titan we have two hours and 37 minutes left until the tax reset uh but take a look here i am obviously really really close to the bottom we have two people that haven't done their attacks yet or you know one out of four uh but to take a look we've done 6.69 million divided by four we're currently at a 1.67 mil average which isn't great if i can show you actually what decks we ended up using here for this one now uh, we did the torso vm here uh, we did a clanship barrage limb deck we also did the totem limb deck um and then i did a thriving plague deck as well so my normal decks but unfortunately we just didn't do a ton of damage uh you know the the buffs aren't amazing right now it's not like we have uh, a really really good one or anything like that but we're still average damage 1.67 million that's not too bad to be honest with you uh but let's go ahead and take a look at our daily rewards here we still need to prestige one time that's kind of the unfortunate part of joining last second is you don't get that um but in terms of upgrade one artifact we're gonna go ahead and do that and then collect three pit levels so we got those to do as well so i'm gonna do one level up book of shadows is down to 45 percent guys i i'm been smashing these prestiges out trying to do as much as i can i haven't done as much as i probably should be doing to be honest with you uh but hopefully during the tournament this should make up for it the amount of prestige that i should be doing during the tournament i'm gonna be doing people say around 10 to 15 prestiges a day but uh you know we do a little bit less than that normally in preparation days but on tournament days i'll normally do more than or around 20 or so so i kind of you know do 20 prestiges one day and then the next day and kind of take it easy and do you know 10 prestiges or so but we'll go and collect the rewards we got here so far so 40 40 presents 20 diamonds and four raid tickets putting us at 2055 presents absolutely insane you love to see it you absolutely love to see it this is by far the furthest that i've ever made it in this event right off the bat like i feel like the event just started a couple days ago it hasn't been that long to be honest with you uh if we take a look here the event starts with 21 days and it's only been five days so far basically 16 days left uh so it's basically only been five days so far and we're already at 2000 so i'm really really looking forward to how this is really gonna go uh you know i guess technically we should have quadruple at least quadruple the amount of presence that we have at the moment um so putting us at a decent amount you know eight thousand isn't great but uh you know i think we're gonna need closer to ten thousand to be honest with you uh but we'll have to see we'll kind of have to assess the situation maybe the last couple days i'll have to absolutely grind out prestiges but i've been trying to put in as much time as i can to be honest with you i feel like i've been putting in a decent amount here but we'll go ahead and collect some rewards here. We got 10 pet levels going to finish off that daily achievement. Uh, you absolutely love to get pets. It's such a good reward here. Pets, diamonds, and crafting shards are going to be my favorite. You do get a decent amount of dust. I'm sure it adds up, but it's just, it's, you know, there's so many other better ways, I think, to get dust because there's really not a whole lot that you get in here. Um, and then we got another equipment piece here, an event equipment piece. Not bad. 250 dust and five more pet levels we are getting pretty close to the 2100 one which is also gonna give us more raid tickets and things like or raid cards and stuff like that which is awesome uh let's go ahead and take a look at the equipment piece uh it's 184 sword attacks so it's actually getting really really close to the same amount of multiplier as our mythic but obviously the the buffs and stuff like that this is flying hero damage all right okay flying hero damage this is boss flying and all damage so obviously the mythic is still a lot better for right now uh daily achievement we'll go ahead and collect that putting us at 2065 only got one more left that's prestige which we'll do here just in a little bit once we get a little bit closer to our max age we'll go and prestige i am going to do an artifact optimizer here pretty soon to be honest with you uh just to try to get as much pushing potential as i can 
I, I was I may even go the route of uh switching to a hybrid right now switching to a hybrid almost right off the bat and then pushing as much as I can right now and continue to farm you know kind of do 50 stages prestige 50 stages prestige and just kind of go from there um and right off the bat not waiting till you know the last second or anything like that because I feel like we've done so much preparation right now that pushing right now is a good idea and I'm really really looking forward to that so we'll have to see how that goes uh instead of Polly let's go ahead and send Hammy and here he, oh, he's already in a quest unfortunately we'll re-roll here and he's already in a quest as well re-roll there we go and we'll go and send off uh Jaws here get us a little bit more fairy gold there but uh yeah with that being said guys thank you so much for watching today's video wish me luck in my tournaments and for you guys that you know your tournaments are probably up leave a comment down below let me know how you guys did in your tournament I'd really curious to know it's not looking great and this may be who knows this may be the last time that we actually go ahead and join last second because now we've done it four times and only have really one good outcome of this so we'll have to go ahead and see but guys thank you so much and i will catch you guys in tomorrow's video peace out